All right, this video goes out to Abai Saini. Now, when I read this Abai, I felt so bad because of kind of the question, and I'll, I'll explain this to everyone why it's an issue. Before we do that, I would like to apologize that it's been 10 days since you asked your question. I've just been super busy with um, just a few other things, and I, I just haven't been around to you know get to your question so i'm so sorry about that i'll try and be better in the future now the question is hi jed was going through the branches multiple outputs outputting your result video and i observed that branch is not there in the tableau prep i'm using i used insert flow but it is creating a separate flow and it is not creating a branch can you please help me understand okay right so the reason i feel so bad is because branches is not a standard terminology you probably won't hear tableau mention branches you won't probably won't see it online it's just something i use to describe what it's doing okay so from the looks of your one you're using uh, tableau i think most likely 2020 edition and later so when you mention insert flow which is if i can open this right that's only visible in the 2020 edition so if you're a 2019 user or earlier you you're probably not going to see this but this option is something else entirely. So just ignore it for now, right? It's, it's not what we're talking about. When I talk about branches, let me show you what I mean. So I'm gonna use the 2020 edition. I have a data set here, okay? And I'm gonna do some sort of cleaning. So I'm gonna go clean step, right? Clean step, and then, you know, output somewhere, right? So that's a flow. I'm gonna do another flow, right? So I can go anywhere along this flow and add another, um, stream right let's call it okay and then I'm gonna do all sort of other stuff let's say I'm gonna do a bunch of joins whatever whatever and then an output right and let's say I go well you know another colleague of mine was like listen can you also you know give me this data um, you know with I don't know a bunch of other stuff so let's do another one let's go clean step and we'll do another one and let's say aggregate and then output right when I mention branches what I mean is that's a branch that's a branch that's a branch so if I draw if I draw a tree uh, don't judge me for my tree right and I do you know a branch a tree like that it's like a, I see it as a branch <laughs> it's branching off that's all I mean when I mention branch right so I'm so sorry if you were look if you or anyone else was looking for the branch option it won't exist okay so to cover this really quickly whenever you're doing tableau prep a, a majority of what you're going to be doing is clean steps right and this used to i don't think this used to be called clean step in the pot it used to just be called step i think um that's primarily what we're doing and you can create a number of steps that you know go into separate flows or branches um, to do your analysis from what you are doing right when you do insert flow I haven't really used it very much but basically I think it takes a flow from an existing flow and imports it into your analysis which for beginners you most likely won't be doing that very much right um, but that's just a guess I haven't really gone into it so don't quote me on that but that's basically what I mean by branches so uh, if I close this, I think that pretty much covers your question. Multiple outputs. Multiple outputs, again, is not an option. All that means is one, two, three. I'm, you know, you can output multiple times, right? The difference with Tableau Prep versus like Excel is that I tend to think of Excel as one dimensional, right? In that if I have raw data in Excel that someone sent me and I have to clean it up, everything I do happens in one line right it happens in like one direction right i can't branch off my results necessarily because once i've modified data that's it i can't go in you can't go backwards in excel whereas this is more like a historical instructions steps to actually clean it that you can actually do multiple analysis as many as you like right so it's a lot more dynamic a lot more capability there's obviously certain things that you can only do in um, Excel, some things you can do in prep, 
So as you get more experience, you get to choose between the two. Once you get more advanced in that, then you start looking at more advanced tools, things like Ultrix, uh, Tibco, Nime. You know, there's there's so many, so much software out there that you could possibly be using. So this is a really good stepping stone to be able to do those technologies. If you look at Ultrix, for example, which I think a lot of you may have heard of, it's kind of, it's based on this. Obviously, Ultrix is a lot older than. Um, Tableau Prep, so it's got way more functionality. So I tend to think of Tableau Prep as, you know, the little, the you know, the the baby, the baby data cleaner, and then you got Ultrix as you know the granddaddy, the the big one, right? So, anyways, if you want to learn more about that kind of stuff, happy to do it, happy to talk about it. So until then, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.